Hello, I'm Emmanuel, a class support engineer here at the AWS in Cape Town. Sometimes customers ask me, how do I use a bucket in another AWS account with my SFTP transfer service? So let's get started and I'll show you how. In this video, we'll be using both the AWS Management Console and also the AWS CLI to perform the task. After logging in to the AWS Management Console, in account A, where the SFTP is deployed, navigate to the IM console. Create an IM role to be used by the SFTP user. To do this, in the IM navigation pane, choose roles and then choose create roles. Now choose AWS service and then select transfer. Next, choose create policy. Doing so opens a new tab. Add the sample policy below as JSON. Give it a name and then choose create policy. Switch back to the role creation tab. Choose the circular refresh button opposite the create policy button and then search or scroll down to see the newly created policy. Complete the IM creation process. Choose the checkbox to select the new policy. Choose next twice. Give the role a name and then choose create role. After you create the IAM role, launch your workstation's command line interface. Enter below AWS CLI command and press enter to get the role's ID. You need the role ID for the next step. Now we will return to the AWS management console. Now I am in AWS management console in account B, where the S3 bucket is located. Navigate to the S3 console. Now I am in S3 console. Choose the S3 bucket name. Go to permissions, choose bucket policy, and then modify the destination bucket policy to grant access to the IM role that you created. You can use a bucket policy similar to the following. Please modify these values with the actual values from your account. We will need to modify the bucket name, principal account ID, and the user ID. Click Save. The condition elements in this example policy is optional. Include the condition elements to grant bucket access only to the IM row that you specify or remove the element to grant access to all IM rows and users from the account that your SFTP server belongs to. Now return to the AWS management console of the first account. Navigate to the SFTP transfer console and retrieve the server ID in the server ID column. Launch the AWS CLI and run the create user command using the AWS CLI similar to the following. Note, for server ID, enter the ID of your SFTP server. For role, enter the ARN of the IM role that you created. For SSH public key body, Enter the contents of the .pub file that you generated when you created SSH keys. Important, if you want to limit the SFTP server user's access to use only its home directory, create a scope down policy in IAM. Then, edit the server's user property to apply the scope down policy that you created. 
connect to your SFTP server using SFTP as the user that you created. To do this, you can use a Linux or Mac terminal. Find an open terminal on your computer. When it's open, enter command below and press enter. For example, run this command to connect to your server. As a test, list the home directory of the bucket. You can also use any SFTP client of your choice to perform this test. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at the AWS.